In the aftermath of Donald Trump's stunning electoral victory, the Democrat Party now faces a new crisis. Mismanagement and overspending has left vice presidential candidate Kamala Harris's campaign mired in a staggering debt of $20 million. Soon after Biden pulled out of the presidential contest following a disastrous debate against his Republican rival Trump, the Democratic Party rallied around Harris and her candidacy. Quickly, big and small donors loosened their purse strings. Money started to flow into the Democratic Party's coffers. The numbers are staggering. The Harris's war chest of over $1 billion dwarfed Trump's $382 million haul. Yet somehow this flow of funds has become a financial disaster, with unpaid staffers and vendors left scrambling. The lion's share of this spending went into advertisements. One of them was this one in Nevada. Harris' waltz are projected onto the Las Vegas Sphere in an advertisement that cost a jaw-dropping $654 million. This sum alone that raises serious questions about the campaign's financial priorities. But the real head-scratcher lies in the $20 million spent on concerts and celebrity appearances in the final stretch of the election. As the campaign pulled out all the stops to energize voters, it seems to have lost sight of the fiscal responsibility. High-profile performances by the likes of John Bon Jovi, Christina Aguilera, Lady Gaga, they have generated headlines, of course, but they all have come at a staggering cost. Experts and donors are now left wondering if this was the wisest investment and the Democratic Party, still licking its wounds from the presidential defeat, of course, now faces the task of untangling this financial mess. For all the latest news, download the Vion app and subscribe to our YouTube channel.